I wish Mom were home more often. I keep forgetting what she looks like. That's her, Jennifer. <laughs> Hi. What a day. The computer kept printing out football standings instead of floor plans. <laughs> and then on the way home, Stephen, the car started acting up. Will you take a look at it, please? It's in the engine, but it's spreading. <laughs> We're having leftovers tonight, Mom. I kind of ruined dinner. But I'll make it up to you when I cook breakfast tomorrow. Did I mention I'm having breakfast in Europe tomorrow? <laughs> Looks like somebody forgot to do the breakfast dishes. Whose turn was it? Mine. Oh. Why didn't you do them? Guess I forgot. Oh, it's your responsibility to remember. What's the difference? You're gone all day. Who's going to notice? Well, just because I'm working doesn't mean you can shirk your responsibilities here at home. Why not? You do. Uh, Mallory? I think this would be a good time for you and me to be anywhere but here. <laughs> Alex, for once in our lives, I agree with you. I think I'll go with you. Not until you tell me what's going on. I'm just tired of doing so many chores all the time. Well, nobody likes chores, but everybody has to do them. Alex and Mallory didn't have to do so many when they were my age. We're not talking about Alex and Mallory. We're talking about Jennifer. Since when did you care about Jennifer? What do you mean? Mom, if you cared about me, you wouldn't have had me last. <laughs> Jennifer! Well, it's true. When Alex and Mallory were young, you were always home for them. I hardly ever see you. Why didn't you tell me you felt like this before? Because you were too busy. Oh, it looks like we have a real problem. Look, why, why don't you sit down, sit down and we'll talk? Oh, I don't have time. I have to do my chores. <laughs> you know, Mom, ever since you started working, it's been no fun around here. Hope you're happy. <laughs> Poor mom. She got stuck with a spoiled souffle and a spoiled brat. How could I be so selfish? I'm so proud of her for going back to work and being so good at it. I want to be just like her when I grow up, except for one thing. I want a nicer daughter than me. Well, diary, I know one thing. If I make it through this operation, OK, which I probably won't, the first thing I'm going to do is tell everyone in my family how sorry I am all the selfish things I did to them. 